Welcome to my first ever Roblox drama video. In these videos, I'll be telling you guys everything that's been happening in the Roblox community uh, from the past week. So yeah, we'll go ahead and begin. So in this video, we're going to be covering a please donate streamer being exposed, free Roblox bots taking over comment sections, new really big hacker incident, and people being able to delete Roblox accounts. So yeah, we'll go ahead and start. So first, so our first thing that we have is Sedice and Rope in Olix. Recently, S Sedice made a video exposing Olix, and according to the comments, people were telling him the information was fake. I was actually wondering if Olix was using their viewers for money, and out of all the evidence, it seemed as it was real. So he was even on a call with him on recording. And he started stuttering when he started asking questions. So basically, Alex got exposed. And so the rest of those comments are are probably just Alex fans attacking him because Alex made a community post talking about him, telling his viewers to go attack him. But later, soon enough, he deleted the post because he knew he would be toast. And about Sedice, I can't confirm his information is correct. I cannot confirm about the rest of his exposing videos because. I don't care about those YouTubers, but yeah. Moving on to our second story is free Robux bots. So recently, Chase Rooney made a video, if you guys know him. He's talking about the free Robux bots just constantly stealing someone's comment, and then the bots basically just post it, and then they bought the like, so it's like the most popular one, and everyone will see it, they scroll down. So yeah, these bots are quite annoying, because he's actually had to delete 15 of them in just one video. AKA is like one of his shorts, but yeah, these bots are honestly quite annoying. Whoever is running the bots is just wasting time because no one even falls for these scams anymore. Well, if a five-year-old actually came down, then they would probably be scammed. But yeah, now on to our third story. The biggest game on Roblox actually got hacked. So, the game called Blocks Roots got hacked by a person who actually used to be an admin for Roblox. And I'm not sure exactly what happened to him. But from then on, he started to exploit some games and even managed to hack the global announcement feature. Basically, he somehow got into the system and he was able to send a message to 500,000 people actively in the game. And in the screenshot, it had like some link apparently going to Discord, but yet, that's about the hacker incident. Now on to our last story, is hackers actually deleting people's Roblox accounts. Now, it's been a while since uh, I've been recording, so you may be wondering how is this possible. Well, here's how the process goes. Basically, the hacker would mass report someone's game to where a bot will automatically check the game out. And the hacker would actually get inside the game and put really, really bad stuff that can't even be shown on YouTube. And then the bot would delete the game and delete and delete the player's account without the evidence, without any evidence or reasoning for it. But if, if you want to stay safe from this, I would recommend privating all your games just to be safe. Anyways, that is all the drama Roblox has, on Roblox has been going on. Really big things happening. And Roblox has become a serious da dangerous place for kids. Like, it is not recommended at all at this point. Anyways, I'll see you next week.